That's when it's my favorite. It makes your eyes doing good. Does it now? Half price if you buy two. Wow. You again. Is this your store? <laughs> no. My father's. How much? 800 rupees, please. 800 rupees? Okay, okay for you, 550. Incredible. So, does your father usually leave you here alone? No, he's away fighting the devils. Oh. The Indian army called him up, did they? No, he volunteered. Really? Well, if it was my choice, I wouldn't leave you here alone. All right. That's 300. Bet the deal. 400 rupees plus Ganesh. <laughs> you don't want this. It's broken. See? You don't know the story? Ganesh fought Parashuram while standing guard at his father's door. Yes, to defend the honor of his father, Shiva, and got his tusk hacked off for his troubles. Hmm, interesting. Anyway, it's not for sale. <sighs> right on time. Okay, look, 600 rupees. You can keep the change. Hey, wait! You need the guy. Oh? And what'll that cost me? <laughs> My sister needs me. How many people do Need to be on that truck before it goes. Oh! So, you're Ganesh. How much for it, really? Not for sale. Papa, I have to be <laughs> what? Uh, uh. what? Don't get me wrong. Decent technique on the lift. But I'd like my Ganesh back. Please. <sighs> Fine. A for effort, kid. People aren't allowed across the bridge. It's too dangerous. Listen, kid, it's been really fun. You need to make yourself scarce. I have a spare bed in the store. 300 rupees. Best deal in all of India. Ah. Okay, no thanks. I need to get on this truck. Bad idea. The rebels, they hurt people. Listen, I need to help my friend, okay? Tell you what, when I get back, pizza's on me. Deal? Dear.
Red door. That's it. Better than nothing. Here we go. It's just an active war zone. Nothing you can't handle. Why are they still here? Can't get out while you can. Move, move, move. Let's go. He's in here. What are you doing? Let's go out. No. I've done nothing wrong. No! Shut up! Get out of here! Go on! I no. shall get in the truck! Move it! I've got the wrong man! Guess I no. swear to you! I said get in the truck! No! Hey, hold on! What's your rush? Shh. Yes, sir. How you. do I know you're not smuggling something in here? Arms up. Hey! It's dangerous to be out so late. Hey! Where do you live? What are you, deaf? Answer him! I said, where do you live? Arabtazon. I'm in the middle of something. It can wait. Uh, yes, sir. Meet me inside. Understood. You, with me. Man the gun. Sir, what about her? Just let her through. You heard him. Get going. Come along, friend. Yeah. We should get off the streets. Our shift ends now. I need sleep. You can sleep in the truck. No, thank you. Okay. Is that the last of them? Almost. There's a couple more in the alley. <coughs> Great timing. Can't wait. I'm tired of these people. <sighs> Pink Lotus. The hell does that mean? since he was chasing down small trinkets all over India. To join the real line. We've been here for weeks. When do we move on? Not until we fix the state. Let's keep it. Keep to the shadows. The army has Holy shit. Right. Active water. picturing. There was at least two targets. One was the warehouse, the other... <sighs> You're in the wrong place, girl. Oh, oh. 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 
You're late, Fraser. Nice to see you too. Holy shit! Get to board the first squad! Stop it! <laughs> 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 You're a professional. Oh, you should relax. You'll live longer. Relax? It took me weeks to track down Asov. The man's as unpredictable as they come. He's just another warmonger with no war to fight. No, you don't know him like I do. He changes location and routines by the hour. We'd be foolish to take unnecessary risks. We? Let's get one thing straight. This is my gig. You want your share? We play by my rules. What's it gonna be? He's the one with the beard. That's the spirit. Hmm. Handsome. If you're into psychopaths. Nobody's perfect. Where's base camp? Top floor balcony. All right. Do this. This will just take a moment. There's one. <coughs> oh, that works. Let's find that disc. Much. Watch our backs, yeah? Yeah. Fraser. Mm hmm. Come here. That looks promising. It's locked. Not for long. What was that mean? Western Ghats, Hoysala territory. Shit. No, it's all right. Nothing we didn't already know. Uh. Shit. <laughs> Time to go. Nadine Ross. What a pleasant surprise. Ah, ah, careful, brothers. This tiger's got claws. A soft. Oh, all these years. And you haven't aged a day. You're too kind. <laughs> Are you looking for work? I hear that Shoreline's under new management. Temporary setback. Nothing I can't handle. Of course, of course. Pity, though. My men and I could use someone of your caliber. This isn't your area of expertise. It, it is a nice collection, I must say. Chloe Fraser, collector of antiquities. A thief? You're working for a thief. Sir, we have a situation. <gasps> what? I'll be right there. The disc. Oh, right. About that. At first, I mistook you for just an average rebel. Oh. But you have managed to find the Hoysala Empire. That's not bad. Their greatest treasure. The Task of Ganesh. Now that's not an easy find. 
What are you doing? Three Persian invasions, three separate wars, and all these years later, no one has found it. We're close. You're lost. And the only chance you have of even narrowing down its location is to find someone who can help you crack this artifact. Someone with an extensive knowledge of Hoysala society. Exactly. An expert in their culture and history. My rates are reasonable. A parasite who exploits our struggle in order to fatten her pockets. Hmm. So that's a no? Felt like a no. <laughs> You've got balls. I like that. But I don't need any more so-called experts. Shoot them. Throw their bodies in the river. No need. We'll throw ourselves out. After them! Only Come on! We need to get across the river! Messy but effective. You were going to sell me out, weren't you? It's called improvisation. God, who's being unprofessional now? What the hell is that supposed to mean? It means you let Asav get the jump on us. I'm starting to wonder whether you're worth the 50%. I knew it. You were going to give me up. Guess a leopard can't change her spots. You know nothing about me. Fair warning. Last person who betrayed me wound up dead. There's your river. Yeah? And your guy better be there. Shit! Yeah, well, time to go! Come on! Right behind you! Oh, no, this is dangerous! Jump! Oh, no! Fuck you! Flanks! Come on! We still have the disc. Yeah. Keep moving. Watch out! Oh, the love is gone! No! Try and run! Lay off, the asshole! No! Oh. No escaping me now! Last yours! Bloody! Let's go! Oh, whoa! Oh, okay! I'm okay! They are going to the river! going out there. On schedule. Should hit land in about an hour. Great. The Tusk of Ganesh. No wonder the whole solar capital was ransacked. Look at this thing. Any luck? I don't need luck. I'd say we can use all the luck we can get. Are you still hung up on a serve so-called expert? Don't worry. If a serve's not in the gets already, he'll be right on our heels. Plus, he's got weapons, transports, hundreds of men. Like I said, don't worry. <gasps> Looks like some kind of key. Maybe. Let's see. Okay. The trident was Ganesha's weapon. The... Bow and arrow was Parashuramas, and the axe was a gift from Shiva. The great battle. What? The 
battle in which Ganesh lost his tusk, I bet we find these symbols. We find the tusk. Not bad, Fraser. Yeah, well. You like my dad for that. Hindu myths were his thing. I'd have rubbed off. He must be proud. Sun's almost up. I'll go get ready. Nice work. to settle an argument. Just for my peace of mind, all right? <laughs> well, nice view. And look. How weird. I'm sorry I doubted you, Chloe. Is this her summer? Hoi Salah. It's not a modern structure, so we're definitely on the right track. What? I don't like it. You don't like anything? No. We've gone nearly a hundred kilometers with no sign of a sov. Glass half full, maybe we got the jump on them. Unlikely. I'll find the tusk. A sov's on you. Understood. Meet you back at the car. Yep. Me? Oil for head. Go down. Oh, look at this. Koisala ruins. Can we get through that gate? I'll check it out. The old capitals. What have we got? Halabadu and Balur. I thought these were Ganesh and Shiva. Hmm. Someone's been paying attention. Ganesh was the guardian of Halabadu, the newer of the Hoysala capitals. Shiva was the guardian of the former capital, Balor. Well, the stonework is beautiful. But this isn't much of a defensive wall. Hmm. Sculptor's quarters, by the look of it. We're still on the outskirts. Didn't take you for an archaeologist. That would be my dad, actually. I'm just a thief, remember? <clears throat> hey. Hmm. Is the rental equipped with a winch? Looks that way. Oh, great. That'll make short work of these gates. What, you're just going to pull them down? That's the plan. Unless you bought dynamite. This is your gig. Take that as a no. And there we go. Well spotted. Shit. He's brought a whole battalion with him. Might even be more inside already. Hey, I'm flattered that he's taking us so seriously. We need to get through that gate. All right, we'll slow down. We gotta take care of these jokers first. You have a plan? Yeah. Sure. We're clear. Just like I planned. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> Careful. Always. Right. Back to shotgun. I'm perfectly capable of driving, you know. I'm sure you are, honey. I just prefer to. suppose it takes to carve something like this? Years. Decades, even. The Hoysala certainly did have a knack for stonework. And the war, it seems. That too. They must have made these to commemorate their victories against the Persians. Looks like they put up a good fight. 
They did. Pity it didn't last. But their loss is our gain, right? That carving looks familiar. Yes, it's the same symbols on our disc. Must mean we're close, right? It's got to mean something. Hopefully, finding these symbols will give us some answers. Yeah. Uh huh. Nearly there. Here's our three symbols. Well, that took less time than I expected. Shiva's axe. Let's see here. Aimed right at those Hoysala ruins. It's an old fortress, tucked into the mountainside. I'll just mark that on the map with an axe. Let's see what's behind the bow door. Another old fortress, sitting smack dab in the middle of the lake bed. I'll jot a bow on the map in that spot. Last but not least, the trident. And another old fortress, just beyond those waterfalls. Trident mark on the map for you. button before climbing up. Ah, here we go. Well, looky here. What are you willing to bet? Told you it's some kind of key. Gold star for you. Now let's see what it does. What is it? Ancient horse large jigsaw puzzle? Ah, of course. I'm making a trident. Hello, sir. Now what? Now, I guess we turn this crank and see what happens next. You think it's safe? You know that treasure hunting is not a good gig for the risk of us, right? Neither is being a mercenary. Difference is when I pull the pin on a good night, I'll know what's going to happen next. My way's much more fun. <laughs> You feel that? Mm -hmm. Teresa, look at that. How about that? It's that massive relief we visited earlier. And you were worried we were going to turn that crank and die. Guess it's good I've got an archaeologist's daughter with me. It must have been fun growing up, eh? It had its moments. I learned a lot. Hoysalar Empire was kind of his thing. Took up a lot of his time, though. Me, if I go... Digging for treasure, I better make a buck or two. Oh, sure. I don't take big risks without a good payday. I imagine so. Like running an army, huh? That's a big responsibility. Second nature. It's my father's company. He retired, I took over. Family business. Mm. Made a real mess of it. Well, you should know. Heard you and those Drake brothers are close. Yeah, well, it's a conversation for another time. So, where to next? There's the fort marked with an axe on the mountain there. And that fort marked with a bow in the lake bed. Look 
at that. Banasharama. Right. Let's turn the water on. Whoa, whoa. What's to say it's not different this time? What if it's fire or something? You're messing with me. I'm totally messing with you. Here we go. Mm -hmm. oh, I'm a little disappointed it wasn't fire. Another waterfall. Yeah. It's two out of three now. Marcel and I went to an absurd amount of trouble to hide the tusk. Well, the tusk was the symbol of Hoysala dominance, representing their wealth and their might. A nice trophy for the Persians. Yeah. My dad always thought that the tusk was something even greater, though. What? Your dad was after the tusk? Well, my dad was obsessed with it. He spent every day and night researching it. All our money wasted on fruitless expeditions. Heard that one before. Ugh. So what came of it? I don't know. <laughs> well, he sent me and my mum away. He said it was no longer safe. <sighs> and off to Australia we went. <laughs> and now here I stand on the outskirts of Halibadu. That's pretty funny. Last stop, the fort embedded in that mountain. That'll be the one with the axe. Let's get this over and done with. Yep. Oh, shit! See? I told you it was dangerous. You hurt. Just my dignity. <sighs> Here we go. There'd be water. Now that's three. You know, you're pretty good at this whole treasure hunting thing. I'm a quick study. Mm. One question, though. I reckon that you could pretty much do anything you want. Why are you so keen to get Shoreline back? Seriously? Mm. My partner tends my own men against me. My lieutenant makes off with a bounty. Nathan and Samuel Drake get off scot-free and you're asking why I want Shoreline back. Yeah. It was on my watch. I lost it on my watch. All right, what the hell is that thing you keep playing with? It's my stress toy. It showed up in the mail a few weeks after we got to Australia. All right, we better get a move on. We don't want a sob to get ahead of us. Should we dance? Try not to break it this time. Sassy. <laughs> Expecting that. 
You ready? Yeah. Just, um, taking it all in. Welcome to downtown Halabadoo. The last known resting place, the Tusk of Ganesh. Spectacular. Hmm. And what? Doesn't it look like there's a dam or something between the two Ganesh statues? Must have been eroded by the falls. So how do we get in? Hang on. Yeah. Look at the crown. It's not wear and tear. You're right. Maybe it was a watchtower. But that's how the Persians got in. I have heard about this place for so long. <laughs> I can't believe I'm actually looking at it. You should take a picture. Send it to your dad. <laughs> Great idea. What? You're one of those cultures who can't work a computer? Just take the picture. Show it to him in person then. No, it's uh, just a few decades too late for that. Look, I'm... Oh. Oh, God, please, no. It's fine. <laughs> Shall we, uh, head over to Halibadu? Yeah. Come on. I think I see a place we could swing over to the Crown. Just a little farther to go. Huh? Oh, 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 shit! Oh, 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 thank you. Hurry up and climb. I'm slipping. Worth it? Impressive. Yeah. No. Oh. Oh. How do we get off this thing? All right. Feels more sturdy up here. Don't jinx us. <laughs> Here's our way in, courtesy of the Persian army. Wow, nice shot. Persians must have had a trebuchet. Trebuchet? Can't you just say catapult like a normal person? A trebuchet is a type of catapult. It can handle heavier projectiles like this one and fling them longer distances. Right. You learned that in your military training? I looked it up on Wikipedia, like a normal person. Ready? After you. <laughs> Incredible. It's our old friends, Parashurama and Ganesh. Friends? Looks like they're fighting. Well, when the Hindu gods aren't off fighting demons, they're sometimes fighting each other. Well, it's not a fair fight. Ganesh uses an arm. I guess it's not really his style. Hey, up here. <laughs> what the hell? This was it. Their final stand. Well, wasn't enough to save their empire. But their loss is our gain. Here's our way in. Nadine, keep
Can you lend a hand with this chap? Sure. Come on, old fella. There we go. Excuse me. Sorry. We must be getting close. Hopefully closer than these guys. Well, this device looks familiar. <laughs> Huh. Well, that's different. What is all this? If I had a guess, I'd say it's some kind of lock mechanism to open that door. Okay, on the left, we have Shiva gifting Parashurama the axe. And on the right, we have Parashurama chopping off Ganesha's tusk. Wait, with the axe? Yeah. The one that Shiva, Ganesha's father, gave to Parashurama? Yeah. Hush. It's messed up. That's family. Come on, let's see about opening that door. I think that's it. You did it. The door's open. Yeah, without any help from you. You're welcome. Salah and the tiger. Here we go. Fingers crossed. That's supposed to happen? I don't know. Just don't get us killed. You're no fun. Ready? Oh. Careful. Mm. Amazing. What the Shiva? Mm, my thoughts exactly. Razor? Ross? Oh no. No, it's okay. I think we're gonna be okay. Okay? Where the hell's the tusk? I don't know. None of this makes any sense. Yeah, it does. The Hoysala sent us on a fool's errand. I think you're right. Terrific. No, hear me out. Ganesh is the symbol of... Halabadu. And Shiva was the symbol of... Belor. Which was the old... The old capital. Exactly. What if the king built this spectacular city, and it was a wonderful target for the Persians? And the old capital was forgotten. So this whole city was a decoy. What if they let it get plundered to protect Balor? And their treasure. I'm willing to bet the tusk was never here at all. So where's Balor? This is definitely not supposed to happen. It's coming loose. Oh. Grab the edge, quick! Razor! Oh. 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 I'm okay! Go! Nice work, partner. Nice work. Put it there. 
Jesus, <laughs> what was that? <laughs> I'm really embarrassed for you right now. <laughs> Correct me if I'm wrong, but wasn't there a huge waterfall here? There was. What the hell is that? Aqueduct. The water's channeling there from the falls. Amazing. Did we do this just now? Well, technically I did. Cocky. <laughs> Look, uh, sorry if I cut too close to the bone back there. You know, you two would have got on like a house on fire. He was also a really stubborn dickhead. <laughs> you know, none of this could have possibly gone unnoticed. We should probably get out of here. Good point. Follow me, right? Oh. The water is being channeled toward the gate, so let's follow the aqueduct. Copy that. I'll take point. I love you. <gasps> Nothing personal. We're not in the line of fire. Up here, there's a breach. <laughs> the Eye of Shiva. Impressive. My man worked for a week and turned up nothing. They probably hired the wrong expert. Perhaps. You know, a Hoysala poet once wrote of a young king who showed mercy and thus ended our rituals. But the old kings, they understood that progress demands sacrifice. <laughs> Is that what you tell your men? All right. <clears throat> so, in times of war, these aqueducts, they would run red through the capital. Those who would not fight, had to be used to inspire those who would. Let's make this quick. Give me back my disc. Come get it. Proud of yourself? A little, yeah. Come on. 
People, you must first sow chaos. I will incite my civil war, stamp out the weak bloodline of the young king, starting with you. Take it easy. You've been out for almost half an hour. Half an hour? Yeah. Oh, shit. <sighs> shit, the Sarv's got the disc. Just hang on. Oh, we gotta get going. Hey, <sighs> relax, all right? Think you can manage? Yeah, I've had worse nights, believe me. <laughs> I won't ask. <laughs> it's good to have you back. There's... There's two of you now, right? Yeah. Okay. Let's go and get our disc. And some guns. And some guns. Let's get that thing open. Andy, Shiva's gatekeeper. That's got to be the entrance to the old capital. It had to be triggered by the aqueducts. Yep. Oh, shit. Asov's already heading inside. Okay, well, better get down there. Come on. No. What do you mean, no? Sam Drake. He's a goddamn expert. He's Sam Drake. Yeah. Peace. You know what? This is a good thing. I can kill two birds with one stone. Nadine. What? What? Sam's kind of the reason why we're here in the first place. Oh, you better be joking. This was my deal. <gasps> Sam went ahead to do recon oh, for me on the disc, but then he went missing and I couldn't leave him You knew him my history dead. with Sam and then you dragged me into this anyway? Your history with the Sarv made you the obvious... <laughs> Don't hold back or anything. Oh, I did. You know what, Nadine? It doesn't change anything. You'll still get your share. Yeah? Or maybe you and Sam will cut me out as soon as you get the task. Come on, man. That's not how I operate. That's exactly how your type operates. And to think I trusted you. Listen. I was going to tell you about Sam. I swear I was just waiting for the right time to... It's fine. I could use the exercise. Shit. You need a hand? We go. You're welcome. You lied to my face. I didn't lie. I just left out the part about Sam. <laughs> Incredible. Look, Asav is getting a head start and we need to hurry. We? Oh, shit. <sighs> Look, I... Spit it out! Okay. Cards on the table. I need your help. Should have thought of that before. And if you want the tusk, you need mine. Look, I screwed up. Okay? 
This is your idea of an apology. Well, if it helps to keep your head in the game, then sure. Listen, we both have something to lose here. Am I right? Just so we're clear, my priority is the task. Not Sam Drake. And certainly not you. Fair enough. What are you doing? Making sure we're not followed. Huh. That's a good idea. Oh, what was that? Exactly what it sounded like. ushered their people into these tunnels. What? We didn't find the entrance. We found the back door. Okay. Looks like a step well. You don't care. Shh. You hear that? Now I do. Don't mind us. She's wounded. Those explosions we heard must have triggered the collapse. Easy girl. Shh, shh, shh. It's okay. <clears throat> Sorry, girl. We're gonna get you out. some of this? Here you go.
Look, I am... Um... I'm not very good at the whole people thing. You're a selfish dickhead. Yeah. You're right. I am a selfish dickhead. Yeah. <laughs> it's good to hear you say it. <laughs> well, did you hear that, Dad? Did get something from you after all. What happened with your father? He was the guy that couldn't walk away. The Ministry of Culture offered to finance one more of his expeditions because this time he said he was on to something big <laughs> he was always on to something big but bandits raided his camp and um local authorities found him weeks later and this stupid thing is all i have left of him I'm sorry. Oh, hey. <laughs> he certainly made his choice. So? Listen, Fraser, you don't have to... Oh! It's a Dewey. Charging, I think. Tell it to stop, because I speak elephant. Oh! She was so distressed. Hey, about the whole Sam. Uh, look, I get it. All right? I've got my own shit to sort out as well. Let's not have that stand in the way anymore, eh? Okay. Deal. Come on. Well, if we accomplish nothing else today, at least we reunited a family. Oh, just keep your distance. They've got a cough with them. Right. Hey, upstairs. I see light through the water. Hello, You know, it's not every day you get to see a totally hidden city that nobody else has seen for centuries. Apart from Asov. Apart from Asov. And a few of his men. And a few of his men. You ready? You just... Totally crush that moment. You know that, right? Yeah, I'm ready. This keeps getting more and more spectacular. And in case there was any doubt, this was Balor. Lord Shiva. Plus Nandi. And I'm guessing that's Ganesh. At least before he got his elephant's head. Could be. Might also be Kartikeya, Shiva's elder son. He's the Hindu god of war. Sounds like they chose different paths. They're trying to slow us down. Yeah. <laughs> In here, Nadine. Blah. Tastes great. Hurry up. We need to catch up with the I see him. Okay. Done. Let's go. Big city. There must be another way through.
Look up. We're in some kind of tonight. Coming. Huh, look there. The queen and her handmaidens. Maybe these were the royal bards. Some statues of women for a change. Women actually played a big role in Hoysala society, particularly the queens. Not surprised, with the kings and men going off to fight all the time. They were also involved in the fine arts, poetry, music, that sort of thing. Balua was their city, in a way. Oh, what on earth is this? What is it? Ancient Kannad script. Looks like stanzas. Could be poetry. This place a library? Seems so. Fraser, over here. Whoa. Look at this. It's incredible. It's an altar of some kind. Looks like the king suffered dearly for their people. They weren't just protecting the tusk. Historians believe that it was a symbol of power and dominance, but I reckon they misunderstood. It was a symbol of their people, their culture. It was a symbol of them. What sort of this? Sav get that tusk. No. No, we can't. Thank you. Thank me after we get out of this alive. <laughs> Fair point. Don't forget Ganesh. He does it. No. Oh. What? Got water in my ears. I hate that. But I wouldn't give her a towel. <clears throat> my God. Are you seeing this? You know, at this point, I've run out of words. Holy goddamn shit. That's what? I don't know this, this place. Throne room. Place to hide a magnificent bejeweled tusk. Let's hope so. I see stairs going up. But they're mostly <coughs> broken. I'll have to find another way up. Is that it? We'll find out in a moment.
the light is shining on that statue across the way. Oh, I guess we're not done. When the Hoysala want to protect something, they don't do it halfway. Come on. Yeah. This water. It's a cleansing ritual. What's happening? Oh, you can put down the mirror now. Oh, shit. They found us! Get you ready! Shit! was quite the fall. You had me worried. Come, it's time for a reunion. He wouldn't give you up, despite my efforts to persuade him. Oh, Sam! Jesus. Hey, you oh, made it. Dude. It's all right. He is like a girl. Is that right? How about we get these cuffs off and I'll show you how girls hit? The hell is she doing here? You said find help, I gotta help. Yeah. I must admit, you are quite the schemer. First you steal my disc, then you have your expert run me around in circles, huh? <laughs> That's clever. Perhaps there's a little Indian blood in you after all. Let's finish what we started. All right, all right. <laughs> so, Nadine Ross. Don't talk to me. <laughs> I was gonna say, you look good. Was I not clear? What's that smell? Oh, I'm sorry. I haven't exactly had access to running water and soap recently. Oh, the people. 
people you could have brought with you. <laughs> she saved my ass more than once, you know. You do remember that uh, she also tried to kill Nathan and I many, many times. And to be fair, you two tried to do the same to her. Yeah, but that, that's not the point. The point is that the second we turn our backs, there will be a knife in there. I can hear every word you're saying. I know! I trust her. <laughs> you know what? Fine. I guess I'm just a little bit irked that we are walking away with nothing. But I guess you know what that's like, right? <laughs> oh, my... Real classy, thank you. Time and place, children. More that came from. Bike racks after school. Ugh. Just hurry up! the kings have one final test. Looks like you won't be needing us, though, so we'll just be on our uh, way. On the contrary. Surely you know the story. <laughs> you see, Shiva gave Parashuram the mighty axe that struck Ganesh in the face, bringing Shiva's son, one of the greatest of the gods, to his knees. Another casualty of war. Don't. Yeah, seriously, Chloe, he's just gonna kill him. Uh, He's right. But if you refuse, <coughs> you will watch them die, inch by inch. All right! <coughs> Chloe, don't! Here. You'd better not be stalling. <clears throat> Shiva and Parashurama. What now? Chloe, don't you give this schmuck what he wants. Quiet. He's yielding. Thanks. It's going to fall. Quiet! Ganesh, quite an obstacle you've placed in my path. Unexpected. Holy shit, she's got balls, huh? I, I don't understand. It's an idiot. That's because you've got it all twisted, my friend. Ganesh allowed himself to be struck by the axe. That makes no sense. Not to a selfish prick, no. <laughs> See, Ganesh could have defeated Parashurama easily. But if he had, that would have made Shiva's axe look weak. Powerless. Ganesh sacrificed himself to preserve his father's honor. See, even she gets it, not a drop of Indian blood in her. <laughs> <laughs> 
Magnificent, isn't it? Oh, what, nothing to say now? Oh, if you like, I can tell you where to stick it. <laughs> well, my friends, I would love to kill you myself, but we must not anger the gods, for you have brought me a great fortune. Okay, then, what are you doing? I'm going to flood the chamber. I will miss you. Come on, is this really necessary? You know, nothing is ever truly destroyed. Only purified and reborn. Just shoot us and get it over with. Right? As the water fills your lungs, you will have time to reflect on the choices that brought you here. Perhaps in your next lives, you will fare better. Prick. I don't know about you guys, but I got a lot of regrets swimming around in my head right now. Well, tell me about it. I was really looking forward to kicking your ass again. Hey, you know, I'm not exactly thrilled about drowning next to you, either. Could you give it a rest, guys? I'm trying to concentrate. What are you doing? A little preparation goes a long way. Ha-ha! <laughs> yes! The buyers. What do you mean? Just over heard a Sarf talking about <clears throat> heading to the old rail yard, something about an arms deal. He's selling the tusk. So much for preserving his culture. Hey, just a second. Listen, uh, <clears throat> back there. Thanks for. Professional courtesy. <laughs> of course. So, are we good? No. I figured. If we hurry, we can intercept them before they make the sale. Huh. And there's our ride. These are nice. There. Railroad tracks. Stop here. So we'll have lookouts throughout the area. Best door on the side of caution. Right, right, right. And then we lose the tusk. You're welcome to stay behind. I'm if just you saying. Like. Right, 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 right. Less talking, more walking. What is this? Light. Sure. All right, well, there's only a few of them. We can probably... Wait. That sub guy doesn't do things halfway. It's going to be quite a show. <sighs> Son of a bitch. Sure? What the hell are they doing there? We got rid of all these Hey, sir. Saying... Hey. You cool? Yeah, I'm cool. Because I need you to be cool. I'm cool. All right, lady. 
case, here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna take the guy on the right. You two go ahead and just... <gasps> she said she was a fool! No! 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 Okay. I think that's the last of them. It's clear. Come on. Yeah, I got your rope. Thanks. Well, this just keeps getting better and better. Between Asav's man and Shawline, there must be at least a couple dozen guys in there. Hang on. What's in that crate? Uh, guns, ammo, maybe? Uh, maybe. I thought Shawline didn't do arms there. We... They didn't. Never mind the crate. Where's the tusk? Well, there's a solve. With... Orca. Who? My former lieutenant. <laughs> I remember this guy. Yeah, there he is. In all of his mullet glory. <sighs> right? <laughs> she gets it. Okay, well, the deal's done. Your boy Orca has the task. Let's go relieve him of it. Hey, whoa, 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 wait. We've got a plan, guys. Like I said, there's over a couple dozen guys in there. Relax. You'll live longer. I am so proud. What just happened? Here goes nothing. Oh! Shit! Got it! Get to the door! Here we go! Ready? Ready! Oh, hi! done with my company made it profitable for starters i think that was a rhetorical question love i should have shot you back on that god for second island i wish you had it would have spared us a sight of watching you turn tail and run all right you just hash your shit out on your own time okay uh tusk please you two partners Either you've got a piss-poor memory, or you're even more desperate than I thought. Jeez, I'm just getting it from all sides today, aren't I? I'm not the one reduced to hustling weapons to ragtag insurgents. Ah, there it is, eh? There it is. Always thinking too small. You really think I would have traded this in exchange for munitions? I don't give a shit. Hand over the tusk. Owl's belt. You're gonna miss the fireworks, man. I won't ask twice. <clears throat> Cat. Gun! Nice <clears throat> shot. Thanks. Pattern's a little wide. You get could... the hell off me. Yep. Yeah. All right. Uh. Mind if you see that first? Um, hi, a third of that is mine as well. You're splitting, Chloe, Chef. Okay, I know you're new to this, but that's not exactly how it works. Consider it a service charge. Oh. 
doing so. It's a bum. What? A sub tried at the tusk for a bum. Fireworks. Th this this is big. Yeah. Those tracks run right through the city. Through the market. So we'll find the nearest town. Notify the authorities. It'll be too late. If that goes off, it'll kill thousands. And that is a terrible shame. But we did get what we came for. I'm... <sighs> what? You are not seriously going after that train. Okay, fine. Fine, you have a plan? Doesn't seem to be much of a requirement in this organization. Are you really going to let her do this? No, I'm... I mean, she's got a valid point. Shit, I don't know, okay? This is not our fight. You said so yourself. Even if you catch that train, what happens? Disarming the bomb is impossible. You're right. Good. Good, so we'll, we'll call the authorities this and... This isn't our fight. It's my fight. That bomb detonates in the city. It'll spark civil war. I can't walk away. I'm tired of walking away. You'll die. I can live with that. Hey. <clears throat> Save my share of the task, okay? Just in case, right? What? You're not going to leave me back there with her. Out! No! I call shotgun. <laughs> Fine. I'll sit in the back. He'll be all right. Didn't know you cared. Uh, he's got a tusk. Hey, did you catch where they put that giant crate? Near the engine. Right, that's our next stop then. Block it again! We need to go around. He's got a mountain gun! Okay, any thoughts on how to get on that truck? Get close enough and we can grapple to it. Are you joking? Do I ever? Let's do this. Get in! Oh my god! Let me help. Oh. 
This is really heavy. Go. I got it. Okay. Your turn. Uh, oh, it's way bigger in person. It's a military grade, all right. Here, help me. It's too heavy. You can't disarm it? It'd detonate if I tried. All right, plan B then. Let's get to the engine. You coming? Okay, you go. That's definitely the engine. We can slide this way. Come on. No. No, no, no. No. I welded it shut. Shit. Hey, roof hatch. Think about what you're doing. Just do it. Come on! Uh. Any luck? Uh. This one's welded shut too. There must be another way. Oh, if you've got any ideas, I'm all ears. The switch! What? Up ahead, the switch house. If we can get to it, we can divert the train, buy us some time. All right, sounds good. Well enough alone. Don't have much time. Sam! Sam! Uh, where's Nadine? Back on the train. We have to flip the switch. We don't have time for this! Hey, jackasses! Can you give us a minute? Shit! Train's getting closer! We got this! We're clear! Alright, back to the switch. Push! Come on, come on, come on! That's it! We did it! Nadine! I've got to get to her. Wait, 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 wait. We have to? I mean, she seems pretty capable. Sam. All right, I'm just here. To... <laughs> Shit! God damn it! Go! I'll keep you in the bank. Okay. <laughs> Can't see any bridges. Or crossings? Well, shit. <laughs> Can't believe that worked. Oh my god, the bridge. Shit! Shit! <laughs> considered myself a patient man, but you two are a special breed of mongrel. Good. I'm really going to enjoy this. Come! Show me how it's done. Hold 
Fight me! Take him off! Need more practice this off? You'd risk your lives. And for what? A city of peasants. Christ, you're insufferable. The blood of the old kings runs through my veins. My people shall rise again. Come back! You should come here! Take him off! Thought you were supposed to be good assault! This is my land! What could you possibly stand to gain? Oh, it's all about what you have to lose. The bomb! I'll just buy another. I'll burn your city, thief. Your people will beg oh. me to save them. Marine! Let's finish this. I'll kill you! Don't fight. One should know when they're conquered. Your time ends now! Oh, shit. And you! It ain't! Now I'm coming! Go down! Gotta get up! Oh no! Oh no, no, no! Oh! I know you! You're no hero! My wall will destabilize the government. The sheep will need their shepherd, and you will have died in vain! I will die a thousand deaths before I let you win! Oh shit! Friendly reminder, the bridge! Shut up and fight! Let's finish this! You piece of shit! You've ruined everything! Everything! My cleansing would have been beautiful! Why didn't you just die? you guys get out of that? You know, I'm just still figuring that out myself. And, uh, Asav? Went down with his train. 
Uh, well, couldn't have happened to a nicer guy. Oh. Will you look at that. <laughs> Wow. Oh. <laughs> hmm. Yep. We just did a thing. We did. So, what's next for Nadine Ross? Take back Shoreline, conquer the weapons trade. I'm done with Shoreline. Really? Really. If anything, I was thinking I might give this uh, treasure hunting racket another go. I don't know of any selfish dickheads who might be in need of a partner. Right. Not you. Okay. Oh, sorry, I only work with professionals. <laughs> And where's the tusk? You go. Oh my god. What? Sam. I'm just joking. There you go. You're fi Ow! Okay. Jesus. Well, that's cigarette. <laughs> Man, that's a beauty. Yeah. How much, uh, how much do you think that we're gonna get for that baby? Well, surely the Ministry of Culture will give us a. Generous. Yeah. Find us, V. <laughs> right? Partner. Elbow. Mm. Oh! <laughs> you guys are hilarious. <laughs> Ministry of Culture. Oh my God, you're serious. <laughs> <laughs>